Hello, in this video I'm going to walk through how to use the Fibonacci price tools for NinjaTrader 8. So in NinjaTrader 8 there are a couple of places that we can find the tools. Number one is behind the little pencil icon up in the top right. If you click that you can get right down to your Fibonacci retracements which are the two point tools or your Fibonacci extensions which are the three pointed tool. You can also get there just by right clicking your chart and choosing drawing tools and the same two options. So we're going to start off with the Fibonacci retracements, the two pointed tool, and we're just going to pick a swing high to low just like that. Now in order to go in and edit these values to our liking, what we have to do, we can't just right click and adjust straight from here. You actually have to click on that line that you drew in between to activate this drawing. Once you have the drawing activated, then you can right click on it and choose your properties. So your Fibonacci retracement properties are going to be a little bit different on NinjaTrader 8, especially if you're used to 7, but I'll show you where to find the settings that you're going to want to look for. Uh, first of all, I enjoy setting the extend lines to right setting. It makes it much easier to look. As you know, we're looking to the right of the chart to see what's going to happen, not what has happened. So I'll check that box, and then under the levels, we want to click right here to edit the price levels. Now you can edit these however you prefer. Um, I'm going to edit this to my liking, which means I'm going to remove everything that's there. What I like to see is the 1272 extension. And I like seeing the 1618 extension. And you can change the, the line type or anything like that, different color, different width. I think gray is fine for me, so I will just hit OK and apply. And then from there, I have my 1272 and 1618 extension levels drawn. The next tool is going to be the three pointed Fibonacci extensions tool. And with this, we'll do the same thing. We'll draw from a high to low swing. And then that third one, we'll go up and choose the most recent swing high. Now, same way that we get to edit these properties, we want to click on one of those lines that we drew. And then after the study is selected, we will click Properties. And now we can adjust our Fibonacci extensions. So same two settings that I care about. I want to extend that line to the right hand side. And then I want to choose the price levels. Once again, this is your preference. You can choose what you want. I like looking at just the 100% for symmetry. So I will remove everything but the 100%. Hit OK and apply. And there we are, your two-pointed and three-pointed Fibonacci tools for NinjaTrader 8. Well, I certainly hope that helps. If you have any questions for me at all, I am here to help you out. Just log into Simpler Trading, go to the Foundation Dashboard, and then click on the Simpler Tech segment. There's a button right on top where you can submit a question to me. Talk to you soon.